compass guiding safe migration. Edo State is one of the most active um, migrants um, states in Nigeria. If you also look at the statistics coming from whether it's smuggling of migrants, whether it's trafficking in human beings, Edo State constitutes a very large majority of these cases. Addressing irregular migration lies in understanding its complexities. In Nigeria, since 2017, IOM has assisted in facilitating the voluntary return of almost 25,000 migrants from Libya, Niger, Mali, Germany, and other destination countries. Most of the returnees trace their origin to Edo State, the southern state that accounts for one-third of irregular migrants from Nigeria. A lack of local opportunities alongside family and peer pressure are often cited as reasons to leave. This is why IOM adopts a community-based approach to reintegrate and address the long-term needs of not just the returnees, but also of the community. When implementing CBR activities, provide employment opportunities and they provide the right kind of support and supervisory activities. For us, community-based uh, integration is one tool that I've come to stay and um, it is a community approach to work on the victims and work on the families of return migrants and work on the community members because again, what makes returning uh, feel accepted back to society is the fact that the community, the family, are also willing to receive them. That is one. Then number two, um, the community-based approach is actually very deep because it gives them ownership, it allows them uh, whatever solution you bring, which is why we work with a lot of return migrants in the community to share their own experience. So it's really sustainable. So it, may, it, it gives room for ownership for the community to be able to adopt the approach. So the reintegration process, the part where we come in as Edo Jobs is in the process of helping them find a job or helping them get back into economic activities, have a way that they earn money or um, kick up their business or return to the skill they had previously or get a new skill. And it's something that's really important for us because when a person has a way to earn money and to see a better life for themselves, then they're less likely to go back into the dangerous journey of regular migration. So community-based reintegration will help not only to empower the returning migrants, but directly or indirectly, every member of the community will get to benefit from the structures that will be established within the project. 